Fam, we got to expose somebody else, though. Oh, who? Fam, we've been talking about this person for a long time. <sighs> we have our old fr- friends on the, from the show. They're activists, Michelle Manos, Jeremy White, who went to a lot of Black Lives Matter uh, events to protest. Jackie One, Lacey. Jackie Lacey. Now, there's a big article that talks about it. Los Angeles County District Attorney must go, and here's why. Now, what I did, fam, was I took this one part from down below, because the thing that really, really disgusts me, and there's Jackie Lacey. She won't prosecute any cops, whatnot. But, and, and to be clear, yeah. uh, Jackie Lacey is protested by black activists, yes. literally black like Lives the Matter. strongest black activist in Los Angeles County. She's not being targeted for being black. She's being targeted for actually not prosecuting killer cops who are killing black people. Yes. And here's something else, too. We're going to talk about that. It's also the who she takes money from, fam, right? Mm-hmm. We talk about this all the time. I'm going to go down right here. It's going to say, throughout this ordeal, family members, local community groups, and activists, including Moore's mother and sister, Black Lives Matter, and activist Jasmine Kinnick, implored mm-hmm. Lacey to take the victim's stories seriously. And now Moore was the, the gentleman who was killed, the young black man who was killed in Buck, uh, in Mr. Buck's uh, apartment. Considering the mounting evidence against Buck, they hoped that the L.A.'s top prosecutor would seek justice and prioritize their safety. Instead, Lacey turned away from their pain, from their pleas, and even from their deaths. In a year and a half, the deaths of Moore and Dean, Lacey refused to engage with the victims who said they were made to feel like criminals. So they're going to and she's making them feel like criminals. Lacey neglected to warn their communities. She failed to protect the vulnerable, choosing instead to protect the wealthy donor with whom she f- had financial ties to. Lacey has accepted multiple donations from Buck, That's including disgusting. one after Moore's death. Wow. Jackie Lacey, wow. Must guess go. what? You've been exposed. Oh, 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 oh. So, Pasta, I'm going to point this out because, you know, we get some people who love to play identity politics all the time you need to support people like jackie lacy she's a woman of color um this goes to show that color means nothing to some people when the money is pouring in this is this shows that she has more in common with someone like buck than she does with with the citizens she's supposed to be elected to protect that the the black and brown people that are being killed unjustly by rich elitists like buck or the the law enforcement here the corrupt law enforcement uh, of los angeles she she would rather protect the people giving her money than protect the people of of color that probably elected her yeah so that is why you see these people every single uh, it was used to be every wednesday at around three three o'clock protesting jackie lacy every yeah. single time because this woman uh, I, she has to go this this is what we've been talking about forever Pasta and i we've covered this before yeah it's disgusting and it's kind of sucks but we want to talk about the the blacklisting that's going on you know um Johnny just put in Ed Buck combo couch. He had to look down for a bunch of videos before he found ours, uh, and that's what's going on. But Johnny could show it up. We we did a reporting. The second body was found in Ed Buck's house. It happened once, and she took money from him again. And I've been the I've been the California Democratic uh, meetings at Los Angeles ones where Ed Buck's lawyer has gotten the fights with people of color uh, on the floor too as well. I mean they've gone after him. It was ridiculous. And what did the California Democratic Party do? They threw the gentleman out. Yep, that's what they Who's do. running for office they throw and the let Ed Buck's out. lawyer in there as well. Yep. This guy they is protect. disgusting. Jackie Lacey, I'm going to call you Wacky Lacey. And Wacky Lacey, you've been exposed. Oh, 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 oh. Been so uh, remind us of the case because I don't, I don't think a lot of our viewers remi- uh, remember the case. What had happened so is basically that, Ed Buck, yeah. who has been, who is, he's a big Democratic uh, donor. donor. Donor to who? Uh, the all Clintons, Adam Schiff, Ed Bauman, all Eric these Bauman, guys, yeah. Eric Bauman, Ed, Ed Bauman, Eric Bauman, all these people. He's if you put if you bring up his donations, you're gonna see a bunch of high class uh, uh, donors that he donates to. There have been you know? at least three uh, young black men found dead in his apartment. Now it, this apartment is in West Hollywood, but it's not even his official apartment. It's like a like a house he has, and yeah. when they go in, the cops find uh, uh, syringes. Cocaine, like Sex toys everything, and stuff. everything yeah, on the that, table. D- yeah. And He's, a journal with writing from 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 the victims as well. They got they, that journal. They got that yeah, as the well. journal's brother had said that what Ed Buck was doing to his brother was yes. disgusting, and he he has one of these fetishes. He's all tied into all these same freaking creepy. And he goes Epstein after people. specifically uh, black young men. Yeah, and not, poor not black just men young, on the street, but just poor. Yeah, exactly. uh, black and he, he, men. Get, like he drugs vulnerable. them all up, like vulnerable, like yes. exactly. Like he's looking for. Oh yeah, he drugs them up and he has sex with them. And sometimes when he drugs them up, I guess they die. So then, okay, a cot. 
two times yeah. with a body, and he's not in jail right nope. now. Nope. He's walking around. Yep. Free. He still has the same apartment. Well, that apartment is just a spare apartment. He has another yeah, house. Yeah, that's not even his real apartment. That's where he is, <laughs> his sex play tour. Yeah, him, you know exactly. what I'm saying? And, uh, you know, it, once again, Jackie This Lacey is the California money. Democratic Party protecting yes. their own. This is what they do. This yep. is what they do. Wacky Lacey, you've been exposed. Who else we got? And we're supposed to have, I haven't heard back, Rachel Rossi, who's running for that seat, mm -hmm. progressive, in this area. She's supposed to be on this show. Let's hope we get her back on. And, yeah. Uh, we can see what Rachel Rossi is all about and see if we can support her to beat Wacky Lacey. Absolutely.